Here's another one. They go to 6-0 for the first time in the history of Rebel basketball. The electric Marshall Henderson will miss three regular season games due to an incident this offseason. Henderson was not arrested, but was found with small amounts of cocaine and marijuana. I'm the guy that's dealing with Marshall on a day-in, day-out basis. So we had a number of conversations. I thought the, the punishment was fair. Um, and as you said earlier, I'm just glad we know what it is now so that we can uh, move forward. This is not the first time Henderson has faced trouble on and off the court. While at Utah, he punched an opponent in the face. This suspension is the first issue Henderson has had at Ole Miss, but he is still a polarizing player. I think they like to vilify him a little bit, um, but I think at the same time it, he brings a, a passion uh, to, to Ole Miss basketball, which really was lacking excitement for a long time prior to, prior to last season. Um, and, and you saw the kind of excitement that he brought to campus and, and to that program. Not only will Ole Miss have to replace Henderson's excitement, but also his SEC leading 20 points per game. That's a serious uh, issue for Ole Miss, and they're going to have to figure out where they're going to find points. I think you really have to look for uh, Snoop White to, to really step into a bigger role for the Rebels all year, um, but particularly with, with Henderson out. Obviously, when you lose your leading score, uh, different guys are going to have to step up and fill that void. Despite losing their best player for part of the season, Ole Miss will look to repeat as SEC champions. Henderson's suspension begins this Friday as Ole Miss hosts USC Aiken here at the Tap Pad. For Newswatch, I'm Tyler Bischoff.